Hey guys, uh, I'm actually making a knife. Here's a sneak preview of it. I've just gotten a, a, an old saw blade, a big saw blade from my friend. And now I'm at the point I need to heat treat it and get it tempered. So I need to build a forge. And what I'm getting ready to build a forge out of is just an old toolbox. An old metal toolbox. I'm going to use a brick. It's a brick without holes. An old piece of grating. Now this is a a, a spare piece of grating that came with uh, with a uh, uh, a grill that has a smoke box on the side of it, and that was just extra. Now the uh, portion of the uh, my air is going to be from an old Intex. It's an Intex uh, air mattress uh, inflator, and what I've done to inject get my uh, air transported from my blower to my firebox is this. All this is is a 99 cent uh, piece of aluminum that's off the bottom of a, uh, a turkey turkey pan. You know they're usually about like this. You set your turkey in it, cook it. I just picked one of those up at a grocery store and cut the bottom out of it, rolled it, it's bigger around on this end and I've just tapered it down to fit into the hole on the box. This right here is just a piece off the blower and all I've done is put a little Gorilla Tape on there enough to where I could slide it in here that it'll seal so I can get, to the, get the air from point A to point B which is the blower to the box. Let's make a forge. successful forge. Uh, this is my finished product. Uh, you got, I got my air source. I've got a, uh, a tube here that connects the air source to the, to the uh, firebox itself. And uh, I did make, after using it once, I did make one modification. And I'll let you take a look at it now. Okay guys, this was my previous setup. This is the setup I actually used to uh, heat treat my knife. The modification that I made was simple. I just extended it out. I took this brick out, and uh, I've got some uh, fairly large bolts that I'm using. And all I did was extend it out so I could use the full length of this toolbox in case I wanted to uh, treat uh, m multiple blades or maybe even longer blades. Okay, now for the coolest part about this whole forge. It is portable. Basically, I'll just leave my two bolts in there, set my grate down on the inside of it, my fire tube or the air tube, and then my air source fits right inside here. Uh, I may put this in a bag so it doesn't smash my air tube because it's only uh, that uh, light aluminum from a, uh, a drip pan. But there you go. It's my portable, portable forge. Works like a champ. I'm really proud of it. Um, 
maybe uh, you, you'll be able to build something like this from around your house. And the really cool part about this is that I don't have one penny in this. This was just stuff that was laying around my house uh, or a back field, and that's it. I'm Billy Poe. Thanks for watching. This is my forge. See you next time.